the heir apparent Chris LaRusso. I've never met a man with a bigger chip on their shoulder, a man with more, not not just self-confidence, but just cockiness, a man that feels that that all the riches, all the successes of professional wrestling are, are inevitably going to be his. Words from LaRusso. I don't agree with a lot he said as far as his place in Turner Hall history, but he has a chance to put his money where his mouth is as we meet the opponent in just a moment. The Mind Eraser. Talking about Remy LeVay. This guy is another individual who marches to the beat of his own drum. He's a little bit of a complex thinker. And uh, a unique style and flair all his own. But he's made some waves in this part of the country over the past couple of years. Just starting to come into his own. I think uh, the future for Remy LeVay will be very bright though. Well, I don't know about the future. Uh, but the present right now is not going to be... Very bright, good personal friend, a client of my own, the heir apparent. He is untouchable. He is unbeatable. He is Chris LaRusso. Well, that's a, a lofty claim to live up to, but he'll have that opportunity at this point in time as LaRusso and Remy LeVay one on one. Again, wins and losses matter here as LaRusso explodes with a drop kick right out of the chute and. You know, you want to give this guy credit for his athletic prowess, but it's just that that you-know-what eating grin on his face. It just turns you off. Confident eating grin? Is, oh, that, is that the word? That's overconfidence, without question. It's LaRusso, leg sweep. He's, he's schooling Remy LeVay. He's making it look easy. But check out LeVay. He's not going to back down. Pace quickens here. I mean, with a chance. Got the drop kick nicely done. You know, you said earlier about uh, Remy LeVay, you said he's a, a different thinker. Is that correct? Yeah, I think that's one way of saying it. He's a bit complex. So he's a weirdo. He's tough to figure out. He's a bit of an anomaly, much like uh, a couple of individuals we mentioned earlier. I don't think the fans... Oh, LaRusso hits awkwardly to the outside. So he's a weirdo. Remy LeVay. Why do you have to phrase it like that? I'm sure he thinks you're a weirdo. Oh. Have you know I have no desire to talk to Remy LeVay, especially when he's taking on Chris LaRusso. I don't think so you'd that... understand him either. What LaRusso's is... trying to get away. Does he not speak English? LeVay is French, is it not? It sounds French, but oh. LaRusso may think he's in France by the time he's done with this thing. LeVay is just hammering away all over this building. Oh, and these fans are getting out of the way. I think Remy has a... Uh... Something uh, evil and underhanded in mind. Uh, LaRusso just cleared the guardrail. Very impressive. Oh, but he forgot about Remy. Again, too busy in his own world thinking uh, his uh, feces don't stink. And as a result, Remy LeVay took advantage and was waiting with a hard shot to the kisser. Remy's serious. He's here to make a name for himself. LaRusso may think this is a foregone conclusion, but in Remy LeVay's mind, I guarantee you this is not. Well, hey, Remy LeVay is going to put up a heck of a fight. I have no doubt about that. Uh, oh! But think of the accolades of Chris LaRusso. He's, he's been on national TV with Ring of Honor. He's he's a, a man who's well-known. He's, he's a man that I am a close personal friend of, and I don't befriend many people. So for all those reasons and more, you'd have to give the advantage to LaRusso. I want to hear you say it. Say it right now. I think hey, LaRusso's the more experienced. LaRusso's been in more big match situations without question. On paper, he is a favorite. As you see a major, Remy LeVay with the elbow. But back to my point, I don't think a lot of people fully understand what Remy LeVay is all about yet. I don't think he's had a chance to fully express that. And uh, I think Remy LeVay's got a fire inside him, a competitive spirit that uh, has been tapped into more and more as I followed his career. And man, that was a huge impact on that suplex. And LaRusso... What's he want? Style points from the judges here? What's he looking for? Uh, in case you're wondering, it's 17 to a half point oh. for Remy. And I'll give I'll give credit there. That is an amazing leg drop. LaRusso gets a fantastic vertical leap, but couldn't put Remy away. 
But, you know, Chris LaRusso, not only an excellent professional wrestler, also has a martial arts background uh, and recently taking up even more martial arts with jujitsu and a bit of uh, uh, of what you would see in uh, UFC gr style grappling. So there's uh, no end to his talents. Hey, LaRusso studied major, pretty much every major combat sport there is, but Remy LeVay, man! The recipient of a clothesline. And Remy LeVay, very expressive in his own right. He uh, has experience traveling this country. Near false situation, lead singer of a band. So, well, he may not be as adept with, uh, with fighting, certainly when it comes to expressing yourself and channeling your emotions. Remy LeVay... Uh, can do all that and then some, but will it help him fight off the control of Chris LaRusso in this match? It doesn't seem to be helping right now. Chris LaRusso in firm control. And Remy firing back. You can see Remy the desperation and LaRusso with an, a knee connecting to the midsection. And, you know, the thing for Remy, all that's going to do is anger LaRusso. Uh-oh. Oh, there's a sling blade! Remy with a sling blade, this could be all! Mild upset at Turner's Hall, no! And can you imagine, what is the reaction of Chris LaRusso if, after all those boisterous claims before this match, he's unsuccessful? Well, it's not going to be a positive one, that's for sure. Caught in midair, Remy! Sends LaRusso into the turnbuckle! Thin padding over thick steel! Let me go for the Mind Eraser! He connects, that'll do it, but LaRusso to the outside. And see, that's why, as I mentioned earlier, LaRusso, the smart wrestler, even on on the on the lower end of things, on the defensive, he's smil still smart enough to know where he's at. Excellent ring positioning. That's another point for him. And Remy and LaRusso dangerously close to those guardrails again. Oh, come on! That's uncalled for. Well, wait. What does uh, he sings? Yeah, he's singing in a band. I think he's gonna be singing a few octaves higher. Uh, maybe a falsetto. That is completely uncalled for to use the guardrail in that manner. That should be a disqualification, in my opinion. Referee's decision is final. I know, but I don't like that a darn bit. Oh, do you want to talk about it? Do you, do you want to hug? There will be some discussions later. Not with you. Trust me. Well, you know that you may not have liked that, and you may find it underhanded, but it is quite effective. And look at how proud he is right now. I'm proud of him too. Mocking these people. Yeah, can I just stand up and applaud? That's just... No. He's letting the people know what they are. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh, a, a spit of defiance from Remy LeVay as he dares LaRusso for a kill shot and LaRusso doesn't disappoint. Oh, Remy. He went down in his own way. But as far as LaRusso's concerned, what matters is he went down. <laughs> <laughs> I give credit to Remy LeVay for spitting in the face of defiance. I give credit to Remy LeVay for all the fight he put forth in this contest. But you know what? Chris LaRusso did win. I don't like the way he did it. But I give credit to a great, great athlete in this organization. One more time. Wait, no, wait a second. Yeah, get him. Now, one more time for your applause is one thing. But one more time for this is unnecessary. What did Remy do to deserve that? He got in the ring with Chris LaRusso and he spit on him. That's exactly what happens. Let that be a lesson to everybody else. 